Did you know that a potential one in five people who visit your website need or could certainly benefit from some sort of accessibility accommodation? Hi, I'm Susie Webb, and in today's video, I'm going to share with you a WordPress plugin called UserWay that will up your game on accessibility on your website. So let's scoot over to the dashboard and let's get techable. All right, here I am on another website about accessibility, and I thought this would be the perfect site to use to display the accessibility tool. So you'll see it over here on the right, and if I click on it, it opens up a number of different options. So let's just briefly look at them. Keyboard navigation would allow me to use the keyboard to move around, as you can see, and that would work on the page. This would be, the one on the right would be to read the page. So it would read for me if that was something I needed. Contrast, clicking here, it gives you different levels of contrast, depending on um, what the individual might find best suits their um, ability. There's that one. And desaturation, and then back to the regular way that I had it highlighted links. This would make, you can see the links highlighted. Bigger text. Let's turn this off. Bigger text can get um, quite large. And text spacing also, if that's something somebody needs. Okay. And um, they will actually change the fonts as well. So, for example, it will change it to either Arial or uh, Verdanda. So the, they're known to be more legible for um, different um, visual issues and learning disabilities. And then this would be for the cursor. This makes a nice big cursor. Okay and tooltips. Okay, so that's um, basically all the options that you could make available to your visitors that um, may require some accessibilities when they visit your website. So now how do we get this? Well, let's see. Plugin is called UserWay and they have some really interesting um, content on their website. But this, I just thought I'd show you this because this is a really good example of uh, just maybe how frequent need that kind of support that's coming to your website. So there will, there's very interesting statistics there. So, all right, and so now how do we get this to work on uh, WordPress? They have this plugin available for all kinds of platforms, but I'm only going to show you about WordPress. You would simply go to your plugins, um, add new, and then type in user way, and then you'll come here, accessibility by user way, and then you would install it and activate just like you would any plugin. And then once you do that, you'll land on a page like this. You'll notice right away down here in your settings that um, user way has been installed. And then the instructions are right here for you to follow. Simply put in your email address, first and last name, and the URL of the website. And then once you do that and save changes, you'll notice here a token is generated for your website. And the reason you need that is a couple of reasons, really. For them to track, of course, that it's being um, installed on your website. But then also what, it, what that allows you to do is going back here now to the actual plugin. You'll notice down here where it says manage. And because you have the free version, of course, they're gonna have their branding there, which I think is fine. I think it's great to promote them. And manage, you would click manage. Here's a number of the options that you'll have to configure 
um, the website. For example, changing the button size. You can see this is the one I have. Could make it smaller, but I wanted to make it more visible. So that's um, why I chose that one. And then you could also change the button type. You could use the visual impairment or the you know mobility. But I again I just chose the um, universal for everybody. And this tells you how many sites you have it on. I currently have it on 10 sites. And of course if you wanted to remove the donate then that would be um, part of the you know paid version. You could change the widget language depending on it's right now it's detecting the language. Change your email and password, normal things like that. Uh, you can change the button color which is great because then you can match it to you know your theme or what it is you want to have it to be. So um, there are lots of good options there which is great but it's just a really very good plugin to have to make available to your visitors. So if you're looking for ways to up your accessibility game on your website, I'd highly recommend to look into the UserWay WordPress plugin.